<laughs> You're going to love this, Ben was all that associate editor Robert Ramsey could muster as he gracelessly dumped February's Game of the Month results all over my desk. Guess what, Ramsey? The titles in this list may well be as appealing as a cactus enema, but I'm gonna make the most of it. Chipper Ben mode? Activate. Oh my, what a lovely game. Fun is what I've heard this game described as. So much fun that EA gave us a whole other one of them which allows this franchise to continue its unending march towards immortality. It will outlive us all. In fact, Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare 2 is so colourful and cutesy, it almost makes you forget that what you're so aggressively propelling at the reanimated corpses of somebody's loved one is plant reproductive material. Hmm. Ah, see, no, actually, I love Street Fighter is what someone said when I asked them about Street Fighter. It's another one of them ones where the people do the kicks and yell at each other in made-up languages. I tried to play this one actually, got, uh, got destroyed though. It's amazing how pressing all the buttons doesn't reveal how you win. After that I just retired to the back of the room, making offhand comments about how many of the moves look like real-life wrestling maneuvers. Got made fun of, didn't I? No longer watching wrestling. Digimon, Digital Monsters, Digital... <laughs> I remember these guys. They were in that cartoon on Saturday mornings which wasn't as good as Pokemon. God, the 90s were great. Now them there <laughs> are back. And you've got to raise them, not like Pokemon though, to battle a sinister evil plot to unplug the internet and plunge the cybersphere into darkness or some nonsense like that. By which I mean good nonsense. Positive nonsense. I bloody love that nonsense. Oh, bloody hell, another one. Already. We get one of these Naruto games once every 15 minutes. Just look at what I said when he turned up in a previous video. Naruto is the greediest man in gaming. Just look at this real life screenshot from Wikipedia. He's had six games out in the last year alone, kind of. Good to see nothing changes. I bet associate editor Robert Ramsey's bought it, eh Robert? Maybe. Depends on how much art to spend. Yeah, but does it really? Somebody's buying them. All of them. Game of the month, everybody. Nice one, February. What's the point? Well, that's your lot for February. Please like this video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And should, for some reason, you want more of me, Push Square has just launched its own podcast. Bit much. You can find it uploaded to this very channel, or you can subscribe on iTunes. Get on it, you wonderful wasters.